Hello friends and welcome back to the channel. I decided to upload this because I wanted to get the opinion of other Ghostbusters Spirits Unleashed players to see if what I'm seeing in the video after watching it back as well as what I was experiencing at the time is as odd to you as it is to me. I highly suspect that this ghost we're using game exploits to be able to get around the map and I'm going to be showing you a couple of instances where uh, I believe this to be the case. But I want your honest opinion if you do believe that I am correct in this or am I mistaken. So I've slowed the footage down to make it a little bit easier to see what I'm going to be talking about here. To me, during the game and watching it in playback, it seemed as if the ghost had went into this wheelchair here. However, it's not there once I destroy the chair. And being that this is the lowest level of this particular map, there's nowhere to my knowledge that the ghost can go underneath. However, it appears to me it comes up out of the floor. As far as I know, there was nothing there for it to be able to possess. It then goes through this window. While the window has not been destroyed, my particle thrower actually destroys it. And it's uh, true, I don't play as Ghost very often, so I don't really know where all the portals are. But even if you don't take a portal into account, if there wasn't one there, to my knowledge, the Ghost would have had to use some type of attack on the window to break it itself to go through. At least I believe that's the way that it works. Again, I could be mistaken about that, being as I don't play as Ghost often. The next example, once again slowed down to make it a little bit easier to be able to see what's going on. I notice a red dot appear right behind me, and the ghost goes into this hall here. Now please pay attention to the floor in the hall. To me, there doesn't look like there's anything that it could be hiding in, meaning it should be right in front of me. Yet somehow, all of a sudden I get a reading behind me, it appears like it came up out of the floor, but admittedly I didn't turn quick enough to see, so I could be mistaken about that, but this I'm not mistaken about as it goes right through the floor right there as you just saw in the gameplay and again being as we are on the lowest level of the playable map in this area to my knowledge there is no way no portal or anything there that the ghost should have been able to do that again I could be mistaken and the last example that I wanted to share once again slowed down so you'll notice I am getting a reading on the PKE that the ghost is right here but as you can see it passes underneath me, and in fact, the arrow indicator on the display is showing that it's getting the reading underneath as well. And once again, we're on the lowest section of the playable map, so the ghost should not be able to be down there. There are no drudge on the field, so it can't be one of them that somehow got out of bounds. It had to be the ghost. And so this is where I will leave it up to you, the viewer, to decide. Am I correct? Did I catch the ghost exploiting the game and being out of bounds in order to win? Or am I mistaken in this? I haven't played the game much as of late. I do pick it up on occasion and play it. And I rarely play as ghosts. So again, I don't know where all the portals are. But again, as you saw right there, it sure looked like the ghost phased right through. That's actually the reason why I got the ecto goggles. But being as I get accused all the time of cheating and I don't, I'm not going to come right out and accuse somebody else myself of cheating. But it definitely felt very odd to me during the gameplay and I decided to go back and watch the video because I thought, well, you know, during the actual game, a lot of stuff can be going on and I could have been mistaken, thought I saw something that I didn't. But, the thing is, going back and watching the video, pretty much everything that I thought that I saw during the actual match was there. And the thing is, is you may notice the name of the ghost as we're coming up looks very familiar. I highly suspect I know who this is and that instead of being on an Xbox that he is now on a PlayStation for whatever reason. However, I have no proof of this. I did block and mute him just in case it is this particular person that I've had dealings with before. But he definitely had some of the same MO of the other player that again, I won't be linking them because I don't know for a fact that they are one and the same. So it wouldn't be fair to link him to the other player if he had nothing to do with this. But in any case... The way that he uses that particular ghost is exactly the same with uh, destroying traps as soon as he gets the chance. Rushing us at the door, with the exception of this one he didn't on this particular map, but one of the other ones at the brewery. And uh, just the overall attitude of when he downs you. I highly suspect I know who this is and that they were simply on a uh, PlayStation account instead of an Xbox one. But in any case, that's why I wanted the honest opinion of other Ghostbuster players. Did I catch a ghost exploiting the game to win? 
or am I simply mistaken? Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. Take care. Good one.